Hello everyone and today we are going to discuss a very simple uh, concept and uh, this is re regarding when, when you have designed the report and how to get .jasper file. So there are two type of files uh, in Jasper reporting. One is, uh, uh, let me tell you, one is .jrxml file that you can see, let me highlight this one like you can see dot uh, new dot jrxml file so this is dot jrxml is a file type name and new is a file name so this is a file where you can see your report design and the sql queries related to this particular uh, report but what you want dot jasper file and dot jasper file is a file that uh, sometimes used by um, used to execute this particular report in uh, a web application so generally web application are written in java and java usually don't run this dot jrxml file so they need dot jasper kind of file so that they can run it so in order to get dot uh, jasper file you need to click this you can see 0101 so this particular button is used to get dot jas dot jasper file let me click here and you can see new dot jasper file has been created by clicking on this particular button and uh, this is like binary file generated so this is nothing but a binary file and uh, binary file you will not able to i guess see the code for this particular binary file let me go to this particular folder and you can see like new dot jasper file so you can see the type of jasper file is different and now if you click here uh, it is not going to happen anything means you are not going to open something like this so let me close this file and try to click on this particular um, this particular jasper file and you can see like okay this nothing is happening nothing is opening but it dot jrxml file got opened why let me do it again i think ideally it should not open but if it is opening then well and good okay so dot jrxml file is opening let me run this one mm, this is strange oh okay you can see this error you find like byte code not found at this particular places so byte code not found okay let me close this one this is something really fishy is happening uh, I will try to figure it out why this is happening like this but usually we get error so if you click on here you will get uh, this particular report and now you can run this particular report and it will run And you can see this particular report it is running well and good so I don't know why this dot Jasper file is not throwing an error but usually in many environment like I have seen that it is throw it will throw an error and uh, they contain a byte file kind of things and that is not uh, being understood by this tipco Jasper soft studio so that's all from my side hope you guys enjoy this uh, video and thanks for watching